Why are we looking at this one? Hey, you. Sexy, gorgeous. Oh, What's happening? I miss you, too. <laughs> What's happening? Y'all brought that old Shame. thing back. My best friend. She one of them best friends you have to Oh, you ain't lying like, today, huh? Damn. I'm your best friend. You feel me? Like, mm. she always telling me, you know, the real. So, I'm going to holler about this Stevie J character. See what she think. So what's been up? Got some situation that body that occurred, though. and I have to Bam. Jump on Ooh. Right. You don't jump on the right then. You Just feel perfect me? watermelon. Go, hey, Look Everybody at that booty. Like <sighs> wanna put I'm smarter than that now. That was before up. the workout. I mean, what you talking before. about specifically? This fool named Stevie J, cause baby mama. What do he say? All I, know is he I don't said know why I act like I care. Oh, that is man. none of my Even business. Stevie J cussing out his baby mama. That's your baby mama, me. but not your girlfriend. Right. But you sticking up for her because that's your baby mama. He's yeah. lying. You may know me as Bucky from Flavor Lion Lion ass. Charm School. He was talking to, to me and his Shay baby Jones. mama at that time. I became time. close friends with Scrappy about four or five years and ago. And I didn't even know. In Miami, and we've been man. supporting each other like Please ever dogs. since. And I don't really think sticking up for Erica is the best idea. My boobs look good again. You think she going to feel like... Y'all got something more than what it is because you sticking up for her like this, or this just... I don't care if she told me F you three times a day and told me she hope I die. Somebody mess with her, I'm gonna <laughs> go over there and handle the business in a good way. Same thing with me, too? Oh, definitely. Well, I wouldn't see, you call, don't call I, would, I wouldn't call you. You don't call me, <laughs> I'm not Yes, she would have game. my back at that time if need be. No, it ain't Even after that. Boo. Even when he was it down here in Miami. Like, like, too, with add some numbers on to that. <laughs> I ain't gonna need to lie about it. Try to keep it on the DL, man. I want this to Try to hurry let up. this grease settle down I'm with me. So and over Erica, this man, moment. You know what I'm like, but me and Shawty, me and Shay, we done came a little bit more than friends. Yeah, because I've known you for years, you know what ass saying? wipe. What is it, 10 years? You've been lying you know, to me for 10 said, years. I, Piece of shit. You're not going to do nothing crazy. I'm not going to do nothing crazy as long as you don't touch me. You feel me? I don't know about to touch Just me. Just touch, hit don't you, know don't touch, touch you. Me. Okay. I don't think nobody's gonna touch you. There go that you ass again. Focus Just on my ass. Just be careful. Ass. I'm gonna be cool. Tunnel vision. Be careful. Be cool. <laughs> Go crazy if something happens to you. Yeah. Put some of this on me, please. Really? I ain't gonna no, tell y'all what happened what after that scene when I mean. the cameras was gone. <laughs> <laughs> don't go crazy. That is just too much in his hands. Like, look at all that. Look at him, just doing the most. Trust me, I am not thinking of him rubbing on this, rubbing this on me. I'm thinking of somebody else. Stop it! Okay. Stop it! What you mean, stop it? Don't do all you that. You need it everywhere. You did. I need it just on my back and my leg. And my booty. And your leg. And my leg. I was trying to do the. You leg. was going on my ass. You wasn't on my leg. <laughs> I'm on the leg. Why are we watching? This? <laughs> I'm on the leg. So over this man. I want to see. Please cut. I'm on the leg. Uh huh. After the cameras went down that day, I was looking quite cute because we did the nasty. But who cares? That's in the past. It don't matter. You know what? Before we shot that scene, I was actually crying because I felt like I looked fat and I didn't like how that two-piece was looking and I wanted a certain type of cover-up. So I was literally bawling, crying. You would have never knew. But once it aired, it went viral. Like everybody was just into my ass and my body. So I guess I looked cute. I don't know. It was my moment. Kind of first time on Love and Hip Hop, you know. That was the first time I got all the lies and the bullshit because I didn't know what was going on. You know, he was feeding me lies and bullshit. What you don't know is I am the one that got a little scrappy on Love and Hip Hop. If it wasn't for me, he would not have been on there. You're welcome. So, my manager had received some information that um, Love and Hip Hop was coming to Atlanta and they were looking for cast. And at the time I was dating Scrappy, we were doing our thing. He had just broke up with his ex. I had broke up with mine because I was in an abusive relationship, the first and the last. And he helped me get out of that. He helped me through a lot of situations. So when they asked who I was dating, I was dating him. So I told him about it. I said, hey, I need you to do an interview because I have an opportunity to go on this new show called Love and Hip Hop Atlanta and I want you to do it with me. Cool, cool, cool. What I didn't know is he came in with his mama, his baby mama, brought his daughter on, and I had no idea until the show aired. And made the decision to tell them because, you know, you ha he had a... I don't know why they made the option up to him, but it's either Shay Johnson or his baby mama to be the main character. He was like, well, make my baby mama the main character so I can get off child support. Can you believe that? I put a check on you, a check money in your pocket. You got bans because of me, and you X out my position? That's just... How it goes, it's life. I'll never trust him again, but hey, I have no regrets for everything I went through with that man. It made me who I am today. 
would like the world to know that if it wasn't for Shay Johnson, Little Scrappy would not have been on Love & Hip Hop Atlanta. I got on Love & Hip Hop Atlanta first and I brought him on. You're welcome. He never wanted the world to know. He never gave me my credit for anything, even though that is the past and I'm done with him. But you will know today. But if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have those bands in your pocket. You wouldn't even be on Love & Hip Hop Atlanta. So I just wanted to tell you, you're welcome. And I dare you lie. Hey, it's your boy Bobby Lights, and gracias for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe to the brand new Love & Hip Hop YouTube channel so that you can keep up with the 305.